My name is Blaise Vinzuris and I am 18 years of age from Toronto, Canada. I have been flying RC since 2005. I have recently gained an interest in drones and my current setup that I am using, it's a DJI F550 with the RC Timer 800 millimeter arms. I've been watching RC TV ever since it first aired. With this hobby, you, you always have to have an open mind with stuff. You can't be just beyond like a one track kind of mind. I was really into RC planes, so my dad was really into RC copters, so I had to learn both at the same time. Once I learned helis, I said, I want to get something just a bit bigger. I got a T Rex 550, and I was just like, this is one thrill that will just never leave. My goal would be to eventually make it a career. Eventually I would like to do aerial photography full time or even start my own hobby store. Even just training people how to fly in my eyes is just really amazing. So it looks like we are good to fly. I have my timer set and strap in and get ready for the ride. So, has the ability to, like I said, to tilt downwards and then tilt back upwards. Now, right now it's in GPS mode, which means that I can go up to it and pull it away and it'll go back to its position. See how it goes back? That is the effectiveness of GPS position hold. If I were to have it in auto level mode, which is attitude mode, as you can see, it can push itself away because it's still get drifted away by the wind. Land still lands by one hand, by one finger. And that was the exocopter. I'm gonna have you take off and then I'll I'll take over obviously and all I want you to do is uh, do what's called the CAC command you are basically telling all the motor and, and the actual flight controller that I'm ready to fly there you go good leave it there a bit of throttle there it's good now you can just you can just leave it at halfway leave it at halfway yeah and you see it's really it's not easy to take off so you gotta get used to it at first so now I can put the radio down and I could go, in theory, I could just go walk past the camera, if anything. You can take a little walk. You can do a little run. You can watch it on the screen, too. You can do a little run. A quick jog in the park. Anything. And it's smart enough to know where it's at and to hold its position. GPS hold and fail safe come to home. My prediction for the future of the drone industry is that before you know it, you will have drones delivering beer to your front porch. That's what I think is going to be happening a couple of years later on down the road. <laughs>